Hello everyone, and welcome back to our channel. Don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel to receive new videos every day. In today's video, we're going to talk about the recent hospitalization of Pope Francis. As you may have heard, the Pope was admitted to a hospital in Rome on Sunday for treatment of a respiratory infection. According to a statement from the Vatican, the Pope was suffering from a severe case of diverticular stenosis, a condition that causes inflammation of the colon. He had been undergoing treatment for the condition for several days before being admitted to the hospital. While in the hospital, the Pope underwent a series of tests and received antibiotics to treat his infection. The good news is that he had a peaceful night in the hospital and is in stable condition. He is expected to remain in the hospital for a few more days for observation and additional treatment. As you can imagine, the news of the Pope's hospitalization has caused concern among Catholics and non-Catholics alike. Pope Francis is widely respected and loved for his humility, compassion, and commitment to social justice. He has been a vocal advocate for the poor, marginalized, and the environment, and has gained a reputation as a Pope of the people for his simple style and willingness to engage with ordinary people. Despite his age and health problems, Pope Francis has continued to travel extensively and take on a wide range of responsibilities as head of the Catholic Church. His recent hospitalization is a reminder that even the most dedicated and hard-working individuals can experience health problems. Pope Francis is the current leader of the Catholic Church, having been elected in March 2013 following the resignation of Pope Benedict XVI. He was born in Argentina in 1936 and was ordained a priest in 1969. Before becoming Pope, he served as Archbishop of Buenos Aires and Cardinal. Since assuming the papacy, Pope Francis has been known for his progressive positions and commitment to social justice. He has spoken openly about the need to help the poor and marginalized, as well as the importance of protecting the environment. Pope Francis has also worked to reform the structure and practices of the Catholic Church. He has sought to make the Church more inclusive and less bureaucratic, and has emphasized the need for greater transparency and accountability on the part of Church leaders. In addition to his work as the leader of the Catholic Church, Pope Francis is known for his humble style and close proximity to the people. He has been seen in public wearing simple clothes and driving his own car, and has demonstrated a willingness to speak with ordinary people. In summary, Pope Francis is a respected religious leader around the world for his compassion, humility, and commitment to social justice. His recent hospitalization was a reminder that even the most dedicated and hardworking leaders can have health problems, but he is expected to fully recover and continue to lead the Catholic Church in its efforts to create a more just and compassionate world. Tags News Today, News Today, Pope Francis has been hospitalized for treatment of a respiratory infection. Pope Francis, hospitalization, respiratory infection, Vatican, diverticular stenosis, colon inflammation, antibiotics, health, Catholic Church, social justice, leadership, compassion, humility, environmental protection, inclusivity, transparency, accountability, observation, social justice, environmental protection, church reform, humility, compassion, 